Dating is hard as an able-bodied person. Throw in the variable of a wheelchair and it goes from hard to almost not worth it. But I'm a normal girl. I just happen to be sitting down. For better or worse, my wheelchair sets me apart. In dating, it's for worse. You didn't tell me you were in a wheelchair. I have a supportive family that has never left my side. I have a beautiful daughter, Achilles, to come home to after my bad dates. And I have a community of friends that accepts me for who I am. I'll just roll along with you to, let's say, down to the corner. Hello everyone, Michael Furlonger here, author of God the Master of Sin and Satan the Beautiful and founder of ChristianWritersBookstore.com. Uh, the links will be in the description below. Uh, this year is uh, rolling out, uh, questionably, but a lot of good news for uh, for me, for the website, and for authors on the website. I just did a video with, uh, with a man in Costa Rica. He's doing, turn one of his books into a into a movie. Another person that I've been speaking to is turning her books into a video game, so I hope to talk to her more about that. But today, we're sitting down with Kristen Beal to talk about her book, uh, Date Me, which is now being turned into a TV show. Uh, um, I'm going to leave the link to our original interview, so if you guys want to catch up a bit more on her backstory, a bit more of her writing story and her testimony, that'd be great. Uh, her books will also be there. Now, I'm just going to flip the screen over to Kristen and let her just, just fill you in on everything. Me, This is a very exciting week because on Monday, February 8th, um, the we're premiering the first episode of the first season of my the TV show Date Me, which streaming series TV show, um, close to the same thing. But it's going to be premiering on YouTube. And um, it's very exciting. We have a really, a, like, more, I'm working, sorry, I'm working with Saltfire Studios, a production company, and we're producing this awesome TV streaming series. We have an um, outstanding cast crew, um, I'm sorry, camera crew, and um, a really awesome cast. We have the main, the main character who's playing Kristen. She's flying all the way out from L.A., and then we have all the rest of the characters coming out from all over the country. Very cool. We worked very hard on this episode and editing it. And it's coming out on YouTube via our Facebook page, which is Date Me Series. You can find it on there. And then also on Instagram as Date Me Show. Um, but we're, we're... Actually, it'll be on Prime and Vimeo um, for streaming, but mainly on YouTube via our Instagram page. I know you only have a few minutes. Just a bit more on uh, what the what the series is about and, and the book is about. So, um, Damie is that's a good point. Damie is um, about the struggles of. It's mainly about the struggles of dating with a disability in a wheel. In my case, in a wheelchair. There's also other comic. It's a comic book. It's a comic book. There's also other comics about. Um, just things that happen in my life because I'm in a wheelchair, you know, jokes people make, like things people say and things that happen um, that are kind of a, I put a humorous twist on them, but it's mainly about dating. So I went on 32 dates in two and a half months, which is like four dates a week, like lunch date, dinner date, just like all different guys, all first dates, all with the intention of, um, you know, dating, finding a relationship, but halfway through, this would turn out to be an experiment. Um, halfway through, I said, all these dates are going so badly, and I don't know why, but they're just going so badly. Either I'm getting rude comments, or I'm just like, people are like overly horny, or just like saying saying things that like don't really mesh with me. So I said, how am I going to make this, um, I guess, make this profitable, make this worth it? So I turned it into a comic book. I changed their names. I made a comic about them. At the end of the day, at the end of the date, I would come home, make a comic, you know, never have to think about them again or never have to approach that again. Turned out I had a whole bunch of comics. Um, so I published into a comic book 
And, um, and it's, and it's very relatable in the sense that everyone knows that dating is hard. And sometimes a lot of the times it's fun, but sometimes it's also not fun. Um, and a disability and it gets a little bit harder and a little bit less fun, um, a little bit more complicated. So I'm hoping to relate to people who date and then also people with disability kind of, you know, show a different perspective on that. And it's really fun. And, um, it's been it's been a fun um, after it came out in terms of people seeing our date and <laughs> and seeing themselves in this book portrayed. I mean everything is completely true, um, and then also people being able to just relate to it and laugh at kind of laugh at my misery, but I'm laughing at it too, so it's it's fun. Um, but it's been a really a really fun way, and this this TV show is really fun because I get to relive all those moments again, except I don't have to actually relive them. I could just watch them being relived. Thank you everyone for watching this and for tuning in and for your enthusiasm and support. And if nothing else, go visit the Facebook page, meet our cast, watch the trailer, watch the first episode. Um, so excited to share with you guys and, um, you know, Instagram and Facebook, follow all the things and I'm happy to, I'm excited to connect with you. Uh, that's that's it for this uh, this short video. If you want to watch the, the original interview, it'll be in the link below. Books, all all that stuff. I'm, I'm rambling. Anyway, I hope everyone watching has a good day and God bless. Bye now.